Not so good. Hello everybody. Welcome to yet another Team Massively Down TV. It's getting real boring. At least his record's not very good. Um, 9, 10, 11, 12 players. Um, loads of fucking stats. I can't even comprehend what his team is. Um, what the hell? Right, he's got a niggled guy. A... 6437 Blitzer 8338 Dodge. So he's got three a blood step there with is that strip? Catcher with strip. So he can minus two dice me, gotta be wary of that. Movement nine sidestep with sure feet. So he's got a pretty good one turn apart from being agility three. And I'm a nine guard lineman. What the fuck? I'm gonna have to go with a wizard, aren't I? Um, yeah, he is unoptimized. But how many rerolls does he have? Three. I could, I could go for the um. I could go for Merc Beast, couldn't I? I could go for Merc Beast or double bribe. Yeah, there's a lot of bloat. The chef would be funny, but it doesn't really hurt him that much because he's got sure hands and loads of block. It would be good for me though. It'd be good for me getting a reroll, but then three should be enough really now. Star would use all my money, chef would use nearly all my money. Get shitty loot grip. I've got 13. I've got 13. I'm just going to get double bribe. Statement of intent. They should only do that, Jester Jew, if they change um, Griff Oberwald to Jimmy Fantastic. I'd be okay with that. Right, so I think... The guard is like extra strength, so having the guard the same size as the mighty blow seems or the uh, claw seems okay, doesn't it? Um, do I have fives on the line? Two fives on the line. Oh, swap them here. Why not beast? Because I'd rather. I, I fucking hate the beast. That's why he's not on my team. Fuck the beast. He's shit. This is a human team on steroids, to be fair. I'm, I could definitely lose this game. Um, but. I just fucking hate the beast. I absolutely fucking hate it. And I can't get a guard. Jester Jew. Oh, is it DFW? I thought it was DEW. I thought it was Jew. <laughs> um, yeah. If, if I could give him guard. Like I should be able to, it would have cost 220, which was exactly what I had. And I would have had a guard. I would have had a guard fucking beast, but I can't do it. 
Thanks, Cyanide. Pieces of shit. Yeah, I've had him for a while, um, El Mato, but he just, um, he's Ducky Fago, but he just, he just doesn't do anything, he just gets fucked. Hello, VIP Squirrel Dude, um, kind of, I guess. I still can't really speak much, but, you know. I do like, I do like Ruladen and Rock Call and Canoodle, so, um, that's something. And I know all the good words like Fotskopf. I even made I even made one as well, Fotzenschlange. I made that myself, so there you go. got a crazy old team, hasn't he? And just moves a random line under it, because I guess he was going to go for his star player point. Crazy motherfucker. Yeah, Canoodle, bro, oh god. Pretty good. Probably not pronouncing it right, but there you go. Yeah, I like him. I like him. He's gonna have to foul. God, blitz, blitz with claw. Foul over and knocked over. I could have got a tackle Pestigore. But it wasn't allowed. But I would have loved a guard. A guard beast would have been great. That's why that's one of the reasons why I don't like the beast, right? Because if you need him, you can just induce him and get a skill, and it doesn't matter that he's got loner. And fair enough, you know, like but the, it's the worst giving away a wizard because you or getting matched against a higher team because you've got a shitty fucking beast. Hate them. I actually hate the beast. It's funny, isn't it? It's funny for a fucking the number one Nurgle coach all times. Don't fucking like the beast. That's why I look. Look at that dickhead. Fucking bonehead. Piece of shit. That is strip ball and a catcher, yeah. <laughs> and of course he has double throws, yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't Dauntless is not a strength skill. It's one of the few things. I mean this is a this is a nice catcher. He's gonna get three dice splits and fouled. Who's that nice? One dice split? Oh, is that two? Oh, it's just strength four. Not right, of course. And a bad, bad angle because it gives up a 2D. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You've got the stats or, or a pure red background. And then strength skills are like dark red backgrounds, throwing and agility. Well, throwing and agility skills are both kind of um, 
Agility skills are more yellowy, aren't they? But throwing skills are in general are a bit. I don't know. General are kind of bluish, aren't they? But sure hands is more and accurate are both kind of yellowy. <laughs> True story though, isn't it? <laughs> True story, little no. He's a, he's a pretty he's a pretty nice catcher. He's gonna get blitz and foul. It's fair enough, isn't it? Oh god, that's a GFI. Oh. Should have stood these guys up first, but it's alright. I guess there's nobody else to foul. I can't foul him though because I, I don't need to. He can GFI twice to get in on him. If I fail, I fail, but it'd be nice to get in, wouldn't it? I want him to re-roll there, I really did. But the question you've got to ask yourself is what the fuck is he going to do? And the answer is not that much, is it? Like, sure, he can blitz. He can blitz the best fat goals with him. Or he can blitz this guy with him. But then, what does he do with the ball? Re-rolled, eh? Maybe I should have done. I just don't think I just don't see what he's gonna do with the ball, that's the thing. It would have been nice for him to be there, obviously. Oh my dear, It's 
pretty unlucky. Oh, both the both badly hurt. That's pretty good. So like, I also GFI the wrong square. If I'd gone there, it would have been better because then I'd have been guarding that guy. So badly hurt was pretty pretty epic. But where has he gone with the ball? That's the question, isn't it? <laughs> Blob skills. <laughs> Still got the claw guy. If you want a nine see the ball's exposed, isn't it? Massively. Risking the game on a one in nine. Unbelievable, Jeff. I could bolt him there. No, he's going to pass. Holy shit. What a greedy. What a greedy man. <laughs> what a greedy man. But um, still, this is all came scoring in three turns is fine, isn't it? Um, that isn't so fucking fine. He's going to have to GFI to get there. He's going to have to stand up to get knocked down again. Does he just foul him or does he put more pressure on? By going to here. Might be wiser to put more pressure on. As much as I'd love to foul that guy. Got the whole extra half to foul. Fuck it. Oh, I could dodge foul. Oh my god, this guy, don't GFI, you cunt. Pretty annoying too. Making three GFIs and failing two of them. Yeah, because that gives the assist for him. That was the worst that was the worst part of it really. Because I'm not really putting that much pressure on by basing him because I've got long enough to dodge away. But then I could bolt and blitz away. So it's a bit of pressure. There's more pressure than usual with the threat of the wizard, isn't it? If he scores in three, I'm happy. So I don't really want to be down re-rolls. Good. Block. Doing work. Now he's kind of, he's kind of got a score now, hasn't he, I think. I'm 
facing him would have been really nice. You know, I haven't watched either of the new Star Wars and I couldn't give a fuck either. I'm just not a kid anymore, you know, like I like I like the I like the original three. Wow, one dicer before he scores. Holy shit. What a fucking madman. Wow. He's living dangerously, isn't he? This this chap. Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> He's helped bash me so far as well. <laughs> but um, now, hopefully... I mean, to be fair, he's got two Mighty Blow, and I've only got a Claw Mighty Blow. Um, but hopefully, the, the blocks and fouls will get him a little bit now. Not for a while, Coach Gaming. Wow, what an idiot. <laughs> yeah, he did, but it was a pointless risk, wasn't it? A pod Eopsis. It was a crazy, it was a crazy fucking risk to take. There was no reason to do that. I was greed in the extreme. Like, even a two dice block without block was pretty greedy for the one in nine of wasting a reroll when he's only got two left to defend for six turns, five turns. Um, you know, defending for five turns with two rerolls. Isn't bad, but if he's doing it with one reroll, it's pretty shit, isn't it? But still, with a wizard to force through the touchdown, should be good, shouldn't it? Well, even though that's what I tried to do with the lizards and rolled a one. And the wizard did do its job on defense a little bit, even, even though it didn't do its job. It kind of did its job a little bit. Maybe he wouldn't have scored so fast if I'd had the wizard if I had didn't have the wizard. I'd have certainly rather had fucking ten more skills though than these um these inducements that I've got. But never mind. Right, I've got to go for the claw hit on the uh on the old um armor guy there, haven't I? Just defend against Blitz as much as possible. If he blitzes this guy, can't get through. Blitzes this guy, can't get through. Seems pretty decent. Obviously, if he gets a Blitz, he will get to hit him on two dice. Uh, maybe I could move him there. I don't really want to. If he gets the Blitz, I mean, I'm going to get two dice, but fuck it. Because he gets the blitz and gets the two dice, my call. <laughs> Fucking cunt. I guess even if I had the guard there, he's got a guard in contact anyway. <sighs> I hate people getting blitz. Pretty, pretty shit thing. Oh, he's not blitzing my claw at least. I guess he gets to guard lock him a bit.
One dice put. Seems good. I feel the need. The need for speed. Thank you for the follow. Max Group. He's just trying to get a fucking blood stepper on the fucking ball. What a piece of shit. I guess I have to ball him. <laughs> I actually have to ball him. Oh, holy shit. Right. I could surf him. How do I even block him? Fall. I need to base him, then I can 2D him. Then I can 2D him. Then I can 2D him, then I can blitz him. But he'd have to GFI in. I need him to foul anyway. He's armor 7 as well, isn't he? Shit. He's armor 8. He not go through. Well, it wouldn't have gone through anyway. I want him to be able to block him, don't I? But it's just not going to be able to happen. Guy is a bit crazy, that's what happened. I do that block first. Okay, oh, finally, finally a removal. Do I go for the... Yeah, I've got to go for the one dice because it's two plus, isn't it? Oh, he's got stun for him. No AV break. Beautiful. Pinning him would be alright, wouldn't it, actually? If I fail. How bad is it? Pretty bad. Okay, fuck it. Yeah, first action foul is pretty safe, though, isn't it? One in... <sighs> can't do the maths, but one in a lot to get sent off. What is it, 48? One in 108 to get sent off. More than that. No, not more than that. One hundred and eight to get sent off, pretty sure. I 
Some people believe that, yeah, Johnny Five. That's what I like about Blood Bowl, really, because it's both, isn't it? It's um, it's both a fun, crazy game with like minotaurs and guys with chainsaws and stuff playing fo American football, but then it's also maths, which I like, and uh, and tactics and stuff. Strategy, it's pretty good. Pretty good game. Even if it is a bit fucking frustrating at times. I just wish there was less removals, I think. Less dumb luck removals. Because they really fucking piss on my Weetabix. Know that you're right enough will still fuck you right in the butthole, yeah. That's true. That's true. Because, I mean, although, although obviously he's ended up on the ground, at least it's taken two people's actions, hasn't it? Which is okay. All these guys getting knocked over isn't good, though. It's shit that needs so many guys to deal with this fucking... Strip ball guy. Well, I'm just the whole blitz. But I guess next time I'm going to stand all these guys up and come in with a Call Mighty Blow Blitz, hopefully. That'd be a bit better. He's got so much blood. Got no tackle still. Oh, good. He'll insta reroll it. Well, that's the thing, isn't it, Jester DFW? I said random removals, obviously, Claw Mighty Blow. You've paid 40 TV for that extra chance. So it's not exactly random removals. But um, no, they don't, they, don't, they don't actually balance out, do they? They don't equal out. Because that's the thing with Blood Bowl. Over the course of the games, the fucking luck doesn't equal out, does it? Over the course each individual game, the luck's pretty fucking swingy. Each time. I gotta just block him, I think. No, it's only two. Hmm. 
Now I'm getting banged on here. Got to dodge it. <laughs> One DD Olga. Now he's got to stand firm. Dickhead. Probably shouldn't have won down the Olga. This is horrible. Hello, Sarah Mall. The record's a bit shit, to be honest. 110 drawn six. Neither scroll dude. I ch I changed the title again. If you refresh it, I was I was pissed off because I was um I was getting banged on, so I changed it to the last Blood Bowl stream of the year. But then um I changed it back to Nurgle Champion Ladder once I um once I resolved to carry on through the bad times. Blitz. If you hadn't got a blitz, this drive would have been fucking easy. Oh yeah, of course they equal over time, but they don't. Each game is horrible, isn't it? So um, like that's the thing. It's too swingy in a game. Of course they even out over time, but you know, who cares? <laughs> <laughs> Basically, like, you know, it does seem like I've rolled a lot of 1 in 36s or 1 in 81s when I've been trying to score touchdowns. But, um, you know, eventually I'll, you know, score. I'll make them up and stuff. But it's in that individual game, it becomes brutal, doesn't it? The, the, it is, the look is really fucking swingy, especially when it comes to removals. More than anything. The swingiest part is removals. Like that game against Schaefer in the UK BBL. Three KOs on turn one. Like, that's just brutal, isn't it? There's not a lot of hope for him after that. Like, it would if I was crap, but I mean... And in the end, I did play a bit crap in the end. But, um, you know, he's pretty much out of it from turn one there, isn't he? With three KOs on turn one. Which is just a bit of, bit of a shit thing, really, in a game that takes an hour and a half to play. To be not have a chance of winning after turn one is a bit shit, isn't it? And yes, that that is balanced out by the games where I have um, I had against this Skaven where I was just smashing in with claw bomb every turn and doing doing nothing um, and stuff like that. But you know, it's the individual games are really really swingy. Like just getting banged on by him, like that fucking fifteen, my fifteen hundred undead, where they just did not break the armor of humans, and they beat the shit out of me. It was outrageous, wasn't it? And like, obviously, all of my collective UK BBL games have made up for that, but it doesn't, it doesn't feel good. <laughs> Is he going to minus 2D now? He probably should. Look how much better shoe hands would be than strip than extra arm here. Just making a Randall block first. God, stop killing my fucking team, you piece of shit. If you just hadn't got this blitz, this, this match would have been over already. Instead he's just fucking banged on me. Massively. Good. Not out of rerolls at least. Good and scold. Got two assists, so I could two D him with claw. Leaving people free to go and do stuff. To one D at the moment, right?
One dice without block. So you can one dice the ogre. I just two days in. Freeze up the rotter at least. Oh, it's fucking stupid. Being thoroughly outbashed by humans. <sighs> Didn't get an offensive drive. Blood Bowl can be pretty frustrating. Fucking blood stuff. I haven't even got meant to foul now. So there's two fucking bribes. A load of shit, aren't they? I should have maybe got two babes and one bribe. But then if I did that, I would have rolled a one on the first fucking foul. Ah, double skull. He's got no rerolls. Good. Good. And that there was why his fucking foul was shit, wasn't it? His foul, his one dice block, um, was absolute shit. I haven't got players still though, have I? Do I block with him and blitz with him or something? Blitz with him, push him there and then get him around there. But it's still... Not great, is it? He's armor seven, isn't he? That wasn't even bad. He doesn't have diamond tackle, so he's not that scary, actually. How does Bludger? Yeah, finally the luck turned. I mean, he had used rerolls before, so I mean, I'd been kind of lucky that he'd used his rerolls. Um, but yeah, the luck, the luck turned a bit there. Still got two bribes, yeah. Give me for cam girl and all you guys, blood ball. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, he, he just double scold and um, and then away. Just don't get a foul or still. But I, I did get blitz, to be fair. I did he did get a blitz on defense, so not that lucky, am I? I'd have rather he hadn't got the blitz to fucking put my offensive drive under massive fucking pressure instead of Instead of getting to make loads of blocks and foul, get a massive gang foul on turn one, instead I had to fucking use my wizard and fucking just give up all of the offensive. Um, what's the word? 
I had to give up all, um, I don't know, can't think of the word. But you know, I had to give up words. I had to give up my vocabulary to um, have a chance. This shithead with fucking blodster. So annoying. Momentum, that's the one. Momentum. I've got to blitz him and hope to power him, haven't I? I blitz him and pow him. It's good. <laughs> if I don't pow him, it's not good. So I can't make any any blocks first. Or any movements first for preparing it to fail. He's only got one turn left. So this guy can score. Blocking him would make it a bit easier, wouldn't it? If I double score then it's fair enough, I would have changed failed anyway. So I think that was an okay move to make. Cause now he's in a tackle zone. I'm just gonna hope I don't want in nine. Or get the pow, one of the two. No, of course not. Unbelievable, Jeff. This doesn't even do anything, does it? That's why I passed. Um, I could foul him, or I could go to here. Probably should have done that block first. It is just a one in nine though for him to get that out and then. Best Fagor is he is best Fagor, isn't he? Being strength four is really good. Strength five when he blitzes. Holy shit. Yeah, blood step is is crazy sometimes and then other times they get powered. Yeah, it's true. It's true, but it's very powerful, isn't it? It's just shit I'm being a little foul at all because I've haven't had any momentum whatsoever. Been on the back foot all drive thanks to that blitz. Yeah. He hasn't got a reroll though. So the strip is, um, what? 55% to fail. Plus the one in nine. The fail is dodge. I shouldn't have put him here. I should have put this guy here. No, I just didn't. I put him there. I should have put him here. Would have been much better. So I, I misplayed. That would have been a 4 plus 3 plus on. Yeah. 
Yeah, I should, could have made him make an extra four plus dodge. Yeah, he rolled a six anyway, he'd have probably passed it. Right, what does he get? Skull. Yep, yeah, both down, good. Good enough. So he could have won this. No, of course not. Makes it a two dice instead of a three dice, doesn't it? Yeah, of course he should. If he was going to take strip, he should have obviously taken wrestle. I mean, that is. That is really dumb to take block then strip on on a play that doesn't start with block. Taking strip, fair enough, but um, I can't make this three dice because if I make it three dice and push him, he can go to here. No, no, he can't. Can he go anywhere? If he goes to here, then I follow and go. I can try and pow him, and then put, go one, two, three, four, five. And I can three dice him. And if he pushes to him to there, I get to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If I push him to there, I get to go one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI. Um, if he goes here, I just get to dodge out that way. If he goes to any of these squares, I just get to dodge out that way. So I think it's better to go to blitz him for the more chance of a power, isn't it? Um... So, yeah, definitely not dodge and score. So, Blitz and the Blitz. I think it's better to try this two dice first. No, no way you do go three plus. That's crazy. That's crazy, guys. You crazy. You guys are crazy. I think it's definitely better to Blitz the Sidestepper. Because I get three dice, right? As long as I can cancel this assist. So, let's go for this power here. And of course, I use my reroll on it. Well, I would have failed the 3 plus anyway with that 1 in 9, so there you go. And the, th the third dice. Yeah, I've only got 2 dice on him, but I get 3 dice on him, see? So it's better to go there. Because a push, a push on him would have still meant I had to dodge. I didn't want to have to dodge, did I? He's best Fago. He's best Fago, so he's um, he's he's pretty good. He's pretty good as best Fagos. Best Fago. Sorry, it's Mash Fagos and best Fago. No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't, Sam Davies. I talked through it all. We're not looking. I push them, and if he, if I push them to here, I just dodge out. If I push them to there, I just dodge out that way. I was here. You can watch the VOD. Clip it. There's no way it was it four plus three. There was no way. No way at all. I could have just run around. If he goes to any of these squares, I just dodge out that way. Right, best Fagor was here. Blitzer was here. Catcher was here. If he dodges to there, I follow and dodge out. And then GFI. I would have had a G GFI. It would, trust me, it was better. <laughs> trust me. <laughs> it, would, it would have been a 3 plus 2 plus if, it, if I'd got the push. If he, if he had sidestepped to the correct square. Which is certainly not a given. Not a share given. Right, hopefully he doesn't get a fucking blitz this time. Yeah. I 
don't know what you're getting at. Perfect defense. I was here. Cat Blitzer was here. Catcher was, what, here? So if he goes there, I follow and dodge out. It doesn't make... I wouldn't have to go 4-3. I wouldn't have to go that way. It would have been a GFI. Yeah, it was a GFI for sure. Yeah, it, was, it would have been a GFI. But it was three dice to power him, wasn't it? So... I'm sure I was right. It would have been a GFI if he had sidestepped to the correct square. Which there's no guarantee of that. He got a fucking perfect defense. I can't believe it. What a fucking. What a shitter fucking team. Fucking humans. And. He's got a fucking blitz and a perfect defense. Holy shit. It's to bang on my fucking. Mash fagos. Nah. No way would uh, Best Fago die from a GFI. I'm sure that was the right play, what I did. You can math it out if you want, but I'm pretty sure that the additional chance of a power was worth, was worth, was worth maybe make, having to make a, maybe making a GFI. I'm pretty sure it was better. I will if I can. I will if I can, Pedro Jack. <laughs> yeah, I was going to hit him with my claw, but now I can't because he's just got all his fucking shithead guards everywhere. It's so fucking annoying. It's so fucking annoying, all this. <laughs> Perfect defense, what the fuck? How has he got perfect blitz and perfect defense? Just the whimsical nature of Nuffle, isn't it? So once again, massive pressure because he's got a fucking stripper that can run straight through. Blitz with him there. I can't even make the pickup and get back to safety. <sighs> Just gotta block him. You didn't math it out then, mate. Oh, I should have followed. Oh, fuck me.
I've got to, I've got to retreat further, haven't I? Holy shit! To be fair, he wasn't here when I was fucking pissed off and telling everyone not to be cunts. But no way is he, no way is he mathed it out. No way, no way is he mathed it out. He's probably done a rudimentary analysis and got it wrong. I mean, that's so wrong. That's so wrong, saying two dice for 68% of the score. That's just wrong, isn't it? That's just clearly... That's just clearly wrong. No, no way has he done the maths. Um, so, because Juegos de Lan, he has um, sidestep and he'd sidestep closer and then I wouldn't be out of range. And I had to get out of range of him because he's got fucking strip ball, so he can minus 2d strip ball me. I had to hit him on the LOS and then next turn bring my whole team back and bring him forward seven and bring my whole team back. Yeah, they still are slipping, Jimmy. I mean, to be fair, Sam probably wasn't here for when I was um, when I was really salty after the first game. But I just can't be fucking chewed with it. That's a great bonehead, wasn't it, to be fair? Great bonehead. Two fucking blog steppers. The thing is, I can just run around the outside of them. Don't have to GFI with him. Don't have to GFI with anyone. I could put a warrior in contact with him, I guess. I could just go here, couldn't I? Bastard. No, you can combine do you can combine Dode and Voodoo Mike into Doo Doo. No, that's that's wrong place for him. In my opinion, because now I can go up here. God, someone's fucking ringing. Ringing the fucking phone. And obviously I can't fucking answer it. I don't even speak German. Right. <laughs> fucking, the fucking YouTube cage is in full force. You can block him and free him up. And then he could... You could block him. Oh, it's only one day. Where's the guard?
Oh, he didn't bonehead. Oh, he boneheaded last turn, had he? What the fuck? Or did he re-roll it? I don't understand. I thought he boneheaded. He can just blitz and stay where he is. Pals his bludger. Getting out bashed by humans, what the fuck? Nice foul appearance. Thank you. One dice in me ain't got blocked, let's go. It's not looking so I need to remove somebody. Fucking hell. Guten Tag, he's breaking Nick Deutsch and hang up. <laughs> yeah. Boop, 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 boop. yeah. Did you hear it? Fucking hell, that was so annoying. Everyone's writing vowel appearance. <laughs> Alright, thank you. I thought he'd boneheaded. A bonehead there would have been amazing. Completely amazing. Would have salvaged the half. Yeah, some AV breaks would be alright, wouldn't they? <laughs> Him not getting, him not getting a blitz or perfect defense would have been ideal. But for him to not get, for him to get a blitz in one half, then perfect defense in the other, and then never breaking AV against him, it's challenging to say the least. Now he's banging on my uh, mighty blow. Not, not with mighty blow though. I thought he'd have hit him with the, uh, with the ogre. Or with his mighty blow guy. That was good then. Yes, it's just obviously, I mean, but that's just through sheer awesomeness, isn't it, Mr. Albury? Just because I'm, just I'm that damn good. But I mean, I know I'm that damn good. I shouldn't have to be, though, should I? <laughs> <laughs> He'll <laughs> get a stun turn sixty. Yeah, get three cars in the last two turns, then and then all will be well on ones and skulls. The claw guy is still in. Yeah, he just hit him with the normal block guy, which was good. Well, at least I've got the ball safe. He, pressuring the ball isn't as bad as him just minus two de-stripping him. <laughs> Freedom. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Sam Davies. The thing was, earlier on, I was so fucking salty, and I was gonna stop. I was gonna stop looking at um, at chat, but then didn't stop looking at chat. But I can't be chewed with it. I'm, I'll put the rules. I'll put like no, no negative bullshit. You know, um, because. Earlier on, I was really... I tilted off the face of the planet in my first game today. I absolutely tilted off the face of the planet. 
Um, and I just can't be chilled with anybody. Anybody saying anything bad. Basically. Because it's fucking hard enough, you know, try, like just talking to the chat even when they're not being, not saying things that I don't want to hear. It's still hard enough. So maybe I should just, that's why I put the fucking thing off and I'll stop paying attention to chat and then I've carried on. I'll try and stop paying attention to chat again. Yeah, I want to qualify for the ladder though. I want to qualify. I want to not get banged on anymore. I haven't said that, I'm getting absolutely fucking banged on. I just can't do anything. Oh my god, fuck off. Gotta go for the dodge, one in nine to lose the game. Well, pushing me goes to there, so I can't do the dodge. He could go for a two die on him if I could cancel his assist, which I can't really. I could get him in there. Then he could blitz him. But not really, because he's strength four. So he could blitz him then. One in nine. Guess I should have stood him up first. He's the stripper. Done. But how on earth do I protect the ball? Answer is I don't really do I. Him, no real point, he's already stunned. Do I dodge? Would make it hard of him to do something. Yeah, okay, fuck it. Do I risk the one in nine? No, he's got to dodge out the one die simply to get the assist, and then it's not easy after that. This is fucking horrible. Of course the fucking ogre doesn't bone head. Oh god, this is horrible. These blood steps are so fucking annoying.
been banged up. All of his, all of his books of pals and all of mine are pushes. Ah! I just want to get lucky. Let me get lucky, please. Good. Oh man. <sighs> One dice blocking is stun. Go fuck yourself. Holy. Oh, now you're taking the fucking piss, aren't you? Bad push from him. Very bad push. He pushed me to here. I, he, I couldn't have played him with a push, but now I can come. He doesn't know where he should sidestep to. So I, I don't think he would have necessarily made the GFI see. That, that was the thing with a, with a touchdown. He doesn't fucking know what he's doing. Push him to there and then dodge out there. Then run around to there. One, two, three, four. Oh, he could blitz. No, he's not strong enough. To be fair, he's isolated all my warriors, which is good, isn't it? Good for him. Kind of easy though when all I'm roll is pushes. Can't even block him. What a fucking awful game. Wow, a pal. Holy fuck.
Yeah, the lack of a guard beast, thanks to fucking cyanide. The guard beast wasn't even a fucking option. Mine would have just gone fucking stupid though, anyway. You know? But yeah, it's really shit that I couldn't get a guard beast thanks to thanks to cyanide still not having a fucking merc option. Merc with skills option. Holy shit. How bad is that? Best five all. He's got so many options now, it's ridiculous. At least the strip isn't easy. Hey, he goes stupid now, now that I fucking dodged away from him. Oh, it's actually pretty easy, isn't it? No, it's not. It's not, it's not easy to get this trick in. Now I'm just potato downfield again. <laughs> okay, now. Oh, one dice into the strip. That was nice, wasn't it? One dice into the strip, but then just got the power anyway first time. Because of course he did. God, well, none of these guys ever break armor. Holy shit. These guys can stand up. Is he going to blitz? Probably he could blitz, but no. He's got two assists, if I could just, uh, I could move him in. Three, four, five, six. Yeah, alright.
four, five, six, seven. Oh, I knocked a guy over. Misclicked on the push. Brilliant. Thanks for the camera moving. I guess I can't afford Riola because I've still got pick it up next turn and do stuff. Holy shit balls. This is horrible. What a horrible, horrible game. He's got so much bludge, hasn't he? It's pretty fucking... It's pretty fucking hard to knock him over, to be fair. Like, getting... I'm j I'm a bit... I'm a bit salty that I haven't been able to knock him over when I've had the fucking chance. Like, you know, hitting the non-bludges, but there is obviously a lot of bludge. I've got to make a pick-up next turn, though, don't I? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then two more turns. <sighs> Why do I always get diced by humans? I don't even understand. Salt levels through the roof today, like, it does make it hard to play optimally, doesn't it? But he just. He's not feeling anything. I'm just expecting armor break every block now. <laughs> Holy shit. I 
fuck it, I'll just block him, because why not? Alright, that's fine. Yeah, Can one foul break arm in the entire game? No. Yeah, I mostly shit talk though. He's a scoring threat now, isn't he? This this warrior, my only scoring threat when I fail to pick up the ball here. I guess he'll scatter it, even though maybe he shouldn't. Well, he shouldn't scatter it, should he? He shouldn't scatter it, but he does anyway. Now there's a chance of it going into no tackle zones. I mean, why why scatter it there? If it, if it's gone here or here, I just get to pick it up and run around. If it was there, I would have had to go and pick it up on a four plus, then dodge out. And now he's just he's just looked out in the extreme. <laughs> and he's just gonna fucking run through and score. Maybe I shouldn't have gone for the pick up. Eh? I guess I shouldn't have done. But I'm just tilted to fucking death. So fuck it. I just don't. What a disastrous day it has been. It's been horrible. I'm sorry I've been so salty all day. Um, I wasn't really. I guess I wasn't feeling well enough to stream, but just thought I had to to try to make the uh, the champions ladder finals. Hello, VIP Senai 89. Yeah, one, one, drew one, slipping Jimmy. Gonna lose this one. Because he just he's just not failing anything. He just simply he simply refuses to fail any blocks. He's still got a reroll. He did fail one block, didn't he? To be fair, he did double score, which led to the breakaway. But I mean, it was just the fucking perfect defense and a blitz. That's really fucking unlucky. It's made it really hard. Both fucking halves have been really hard due to perfect defense. I had no momentum either half. And obviously, normally, the offense has all the momentum. Wasn't even able to make two Ds on the LOS, for fuck's sake. Both halves. Because those bribes, both halves, I could have made loads of two Ds and then, um, and then massive gang fouls. And instead, I had to make unassisted fouls to well, as I was getting in a position to assist to make fucking one dice blocks it was horrific absolutely horrific but yeah I probably shouldn't have gone for the pick up there so I guess I played bad too and who knows maybe my play was wrong going for the 3D on the catcher, but I think it was the right play. Wow, he failed the thing. Unbelievable. 
Unbelievable, Jeff. Right, I've got to think about not losing now, haven't I, rather than trying to win. He's still got two turns left. I've got no re-rolls. Best Fagor can 3D this fuck. Oh, this guy can come in. I don't know. I can't do anything. Canoring threat. Can't even see where anyone is. Best fight goes. Oh, he's down. <laughs> yeah, maybe Sniper Wolf. And now he just wins easily, doesn't he? Fuck's sake. I tried to be as safe as possible there as well. Because obviously what I could have done was I could have blitzed him and then gone for the pickup and stuff and then stood him up and tried to But I thought, I'll just blitz and just cover the ball. And instead, double score. Fucking loss. Losing to this shit coach with a shit team. But I mean, I was 300 and odd TV down. <sighs> 370 TV down. <sighs> and like, he hasn't played bad, to be fair. It was a bit high saying this shit coach. But I mean, he hasn't got a good record. He hasn't really played bad. Um, he's got his, he's, he's always had his blood steppers around the ball. And obviously, I've fucking had loads of ch loads of fucking hits, and I've just done nothing. Made one KO in the entire game. It's, but then I haven't had any offensive fucking. I haven't had any momentum ever for the whole game. I was just always on the back foot. I haven't bolted his fucking blood stepper on turn one on like my turn one of my drivers. Horrific. Banged on. He did do that one dice before he scored as well. That was that was really bad. But I mean, he hasn't played terribly. And obviously, it's not hard to just fucking move your movement eight blood steppers around the ball. Isn't hard. But fucking hell. Pretty annoying. Come on, fail the pickle. Give me a chance. He didn't see any bad skill choices. He's got block and strip on the guy. Block and strip instead of wrestle and strip. But then obviously he's got a blood step, which is good. He's got... Well, humans are shit. He's got a fucking break tackle holder with juggernaut. He's got armor 7 on his... Movement 6, armor 7 on his blitzer. He's, he's niggled as well as thrower. His ogre's niggled. Um, he's got an armor... Up lineman. He's got loads of stats which are pretty bloaty.
<laughs> Can't ever break this guy's armor. I broke his armor! Dead! Stand for. Oh, I finally failed a thing. Unbelievable! It wasn't dead, dead, was it? I think he survived. He survived somehow. He didn't play bad, but it's a shit. It's humans. Humans are always shit. By definition, humans are always a shit team. Yeah, no, I know he can start. He can score with this guy as well. Movement six, armor seven is terrible, isn't it? Come on. The big guy with juggernaut and break tackles, shit. He hasn't used juggernaut or break tackle this game. Movement Blitzer, he could have been Mighty Blow. He's got loads of dodge, which is good, obviously, but... What's this? Sure feet. On his movement, nine catches. Bit shit, isn't it? I mean, I guess it's not that bad. There's not much else he can take. But he shouldn't have taken it before sidestep. AG up on his throw, but he hasn't got block or dodge. He's got that on his... He's got block on his other one. With movement. He's got two throwers, which is a bit shit. It's not a great team, and he's won 17, lost 13. Dead minus agility, all right, fair enough. He should have taken, um, should have taken the death to give me a rotter then, shouldn't he? Prick. I didn't follow. So, so he's, he, has, he hasn't played great, has he? Extra, extra rolls he didn't need to make. Still pretty easy for him. I don't know if I'll be playing again this year. Um, maybe. But um, I'm playing OCC in two hours' time. How did, how did I even get 13 AV breaks? He fucking, that just doesn't make any sense. Oh, I guess I made loads of fouls, but even then, I, I blocked him 63 to 54. Crazy. Fucking crazy. I 
There's no time mishaps. I don't have time to play all of... I don't have enough time to play that much. That's the thing. I got a dirty player at least. Um, no, no star player point for him. No extra touchdown for him. Um, so there you go. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.